what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back it's your boy man terry bike reaction yeah. <laughs> anyways guys thank you guys so much for tuning in man as always you guys show love i accept it it's just it's just how the world works um and i show back love <laughs> you know um anyway um slam dunk man episode 42 here today continuing on with the series um i'm trying to do as many episodes as possible um in this session that i'm sitting down here i might do four i might do five i might do six we'll see how things go and how much i'm gonna put on early reactions okay i am re reacting to this on the day off when it's supposed to be out so we'll see how it goes you might get these episodes late tonight and then there'll be a couple more on early access depending on how much i do in this session um we'll see how it goes but in any case fujima <laughs> i was trolling the hell out of him because i because when it comes on to to um characters like this that are so hyped up before they come in you know then you have people in the comment section <laughs> that defend them <laughs> you know um he's like he's just that good and i get it i i know he's gonna be pivotal for them and this game is probably gonna go down to the wire and i get it okay it's the introduction of the character that i was trolling the entire time because that is just how it, it's just anime does this <laughs> You know what I'm saying? And just TV shows in general, they'll do this for new characters that they're trying to view. I knew he was going to do the jacket thing. You know what I'm saying? Flip off the jacket. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's like, I'm coming in now. <laughs> you know? So, um, yeah, I was just trolling, man, um, the character. Because I know, he, I know he's going to be good, guys. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know. Okay? So, don't, you know you know don't worry about it i'm not saying i don't like the character what i'm saying is that the introduction of the character and anime always over exaggerate these introductions as if they're i mean the way how the character is introduced you would think that this guy was gonna come in and shoot a shot and it's gonna go for 50 points <laughs> you know what i'm saying or you know what I'm saying? He, he, that's what he's going to do in the entire game. Like, he's going to come in and just score 60. Nobody else is going to score. And he's going to break Will Chamberlain's um, record in the NBA. Score 100 points. You know what I'm saying? Like, the hover hypeness <laughs> of the character when it comes on to the introduction. I'm not talking about his play in general. Just wanted you guys to know that because I did see a couple of comments that thought I was like maybe thought I was looking down on the character. I really was just trolling, but it is whatever. Some people knew that I was trolling, some people didn't know. So I had to say that. Um, but any but in any case. Um we're gonna jump in, see what Fujima has to offer. He's already, you know, changed some things about the game so i'm looking forward to that our team might be in trouble we don't know i don't know if they're gonna win or they're gonna lose i mean we're still pretty early on well not really early on because we're like 40 something episodes in um now with the anime going on like 100 episodes i know the manga continues i know the manga continues but i don't know where the sword they could lose this game and they have but i think this is akagi's I think this is his last year, right? If I'm not mistaken. He's not a first year. He's like a third year, right? Um, I don't know how the Japanese school system works. Um, I think this is his final year in high school, if I'm not mistaken. But we'll, we'll, I guess we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Anyways, thank you guys so much for tuning in, as always. Let's go watch the episodes. I will see you guys for the review. Okay, that was episode 42 and 43. 
and they're feeling the pressure right now. Mitsui can't score. Um, um, he shoot once. This is the first time I ever saw him miss, but that's because everything is off. Like he's he's forcing the issue, which he shouldn't be forcing the issue. And also, I I get that the other players are being guarded very closely. You know what I'm saying? It's not even one on one. It's freaking, um, <clears throat> you know, zone defense. So as far as I as far as I can see. I don't know if Shoku is going to win this game because they're, now they're up by 12. Hanamichi got his fourth foul. So you only got one foul left before you fall, he fouls out. And he's not playing. He's not going for rebounds aggressively anymore So because he doesn't want to foul out, which... Um, at the end of the day, you still got to play defense. You still got to play defense. You still got to try to grab rebounds. And I think him being timid right now or whatever the situation is, is going to hurt the team. And that's the reason why, I mean, it's already hurt the team because now they're out by 12, right? So they are feeling the pressure. They're feeling the pressure and it's, it's hitting them hard. And I want them to, to break out of this funk because... Mitsui has to realize that when you are the best, you are just the best. You can't, you know what I'm saying? At this point, you're letting Rukawa show you up. And I, and in my opinion, I think Mitsui is a better shooter, not an overall basketball player than Rukawa. I think Rukawa is an overall basketball player. Like he has all the skills, you know what I'm saying? He has all the skills, but it's kind of like comparing lebron james to steph curry you know what i'm saying like overall lebron is a better basketball player but when it comes on to shooting lebron can't hold a candle to steph curry so regardless of if you know lebron is not going to go down as the greatest shooter of all time like that's not his aim you know what i'm saying lebron was never considered to be that dude no don't get me wrong LeBron is a knockdown shooter, you know, now in his later years in his career, you know, he's one of the best shooters on the court, no doubt, but that's what I'm saying. When it comes on to Mitsui, Mitsui is money from mid, from three-pointer. The guy doesn't miss. He's, he's shooting at probably like a 90% clip at this point. Maybe they're just not showing his misses to us, but... As far as I know, and from us watching him, he's shooting at probably somewhere around the 90s, 90% clip. Um, so that's unprecedented. That doesn't happen. So um, in any case, he's doing what he needs to do to get the team done. He's got to snap out of it because as a shooter, you're going to get blocked. It's not impossible for you to not make shots, for you to make every shot every time you pull up. That's literally and figuratively <laughs> impossible okay so um uh in a in a grounded way you get what i'm saying like in real life and in a grounded even a exaggerated anime it it should just not happen like nobody is that good making 100 percent of their shots you're gonna get blocked at some point somebody's gonna step up block one of your shots um so in any case it's pretty cool to see you know what i'm saying i want to see them propel themselves above this challenge and win because it's going to be oh so much more sweet so thank you guys so much for tuning in that is all i have to say about these two episodes they were really good exciting but i'm a little worried um i don't like the fact that the people for shoko is not cheering though they need to keep cheering i know the other team you know they have their band and they have their their, their stuff and that's the, the thing about it is, is is that you can't get as a fan you can't get too demoralized to not keep cheering on your team because then they start feeling the pressure you get what i'm saying of they don't have that kind of that booster behind them anymore to push them and propel them forward and it could cause the team to give up you know what i'm saying if they're that type of people that feed off the crowd's energy and stuff like that it could cause them to give up but i don't see shoku doing that 
um, but they got to cheer them and they got to do something. You know what I'm saying? I know there's a couple people up there still cheering them on, but the whole crowd is like, when Shoko took the lead, the place erupted. The, the, our side of things, they, they erupted. You got to cheer them even when they're like two points down, four points down. You got to keep cheering. You got to still cheer defense. You got you to gotta still do it. That's your job as a fan. Even when I'm at home watching NBA games and I'm watching my team play, I still want to see them win. Even when they're down, I still want to see them win. So I'm cheering them on the anxiety. The anxiety. I'm here. I'm not there, but I'm trying to, you know what I'm saying? Give them my energy, Dragon Ball style. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So um, pretty cool stuff to see. Anyways, we're out. Like, comment. You know what to do. I'm out.